Hey guys, Grady here, going on a nature walk through the neighborhood right now. And with me, I got Robert and Julie. We're just taking a walk through the neighborhood. Just decided to, you know, get out for a while. Go take a, um, go take a nature walk. It's fun doing this. It's a little hot out, but I'll be able to, you know, handle it. Anyways, it's it's been a good day. It's about um, close to one o'clock, maybe. So, you know, maybe a little after. I don't know. But this video probably won't be going up, you know, for for a while. It might, but I I don't know. Um, anyways, we are in um, nature. As you can see, there are, you know surrounded by trees this is the neighborhood and so far it's you know been a calm day we're not um you know we're not doing anything too crazy it is a monday and that is when i will be uploading most of my nature walk videos are on mondays and tuesdays because those are always you know my my days off so I have a very consistent work schedule and I'll also be taking nature walks a lot after work and you know I won't always have these two with me might just have one of them or maybe a couple of my other dogs with me or I don't know um, anyways guys just wanted to show you Robert there he's about a year old Julie there she's gonna be 14 in January Gosh, I can't even believe that. It's so weird to me. Um, but yeah, guys, just, you know, I'm taking a walk through nature. It's been a very, very, very um, pretty day so far. Nice breeze, too. I love the breezy days there. They're always my, uh, you know, my favorite days. The breezy ones. I'm not a huge fan of the heat, so... You know, when it gets really, really hot out, it's like, mm, mm not doing it. And as you guys all know, I'm also Sims 3 Forever Dude, so for those of you who are, you know, no, nope, don't do that, Robert. For those of you who are, you know, subscribed to that channel, make sure you come subscribe to, to this one, too, because, you know, this one is, I'm hoping to gain more subscribers on this one. I currently have, like, seven. Come on, Julie, honey. Um, so that'll be, that, that'll be really, you know, really, really fun. I, I really want to have, you know, as many subscribers as possible. And, uh, I will hopefully be doing a Q and A at some point. So, um, so you guys just, you know, ask me questions and, uh, I'll be showing you guys my cats as well. So, you know, I'll be doing that. I think that'll be pretty cool. Doing okay, Julie, honey? Julie's really getting up there in age. But she's made it this far. Anyways, guys, we're walking down the road, but as you can see, you know, there are a lot of a lot of trees here. The aspens, and let me stop here for a second and talk. The aspens lost, you know, their um oh, hang on guys. I know, those are my shoes. The aspens here lost their leaves like back last September and normally they start coming back in March, but the ones here didn't start getting, oops, hang on, hon, hang on, hon, come here. Sorry guys, the ones here, you know, they didn't start getting theirs back until I think like May maybe. But yeah guys, that's, that's really, you know, what's been, been happening, we've had, a very 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 bad season though it's been really really hot like right now there's no breeze it feels like it's 150 degrees it's so hot outside and we've been in this you know heat wave since since last june so that's been like basically almost um a year and a quarter of another year of summer and that's that's not been pleasant or, or fun, let me tell you. I'm a cold weather person. I really, really would like the snow. So, 
you know, I'm not walking too fast because old Julie here doesn't, you know, walk very fast or very far anymore, but I figure this is good for her, you know, it'll keep her strength up and, you know, over time she'll grow more used to it and she'll, you know, she'll, she'll be really accustomed to doing it and I think she'll have more fun in life and, you know, it'll be better than her lying around a lot like she does when, when we're at home. But yeah, she's, we've got, we've got a big lifetime ahead of us, I know that. We've had her since she was a puppy, of course. Um, we got um, a couple of cats at home as well, and we got lots more dogs, and I came in, but they're all off doing their own thing right now. They, they like to uh, explore this, this area. They, they like to, and they'll go way off, you can see up there, that's back country. They'll go way off into that back country. They'll, although Coswell, who's the Cayman, usually he'll come home, you know, like around, I don't know, he'll come home with some of the dogs before the, the other dogs will because Coswell, you know, he needs water and I always make sure to like dig a big hole and just fill it with or not dig a big hole, I always make sure to fill my kiddie pool, you know, with water. He he drinks the water and he likes getting sprayed with the hose, so so I make sure to do that. It's he's he's adapting though. He's a lot better than he was just, you know, when he came home for the summer back in you know March. Robert, get over here. Get over here. Um he came back home and it it was pretty fun, you know, it was fun seeing him back and he got really, 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 like really excited to see me and he'd like more than doubled in size and he was, he just, he just got really, really big while he was gone and, you know, I missed him and, you know, but that's what's been happening. Robert quit that. Um, Robert's growling or something. There ain't nothing over here, I don't think. But if there is, you know, hopefully it's an animal. So that's what this is about. So, as you guys can see, the rock formation is kind of red. This looks like desert bushes, but that's because I live in desert country NRA, which is north region of America. There's the U.S. American Rockies over there, as you can see, no snow on them. Climate change has really, you know, been a, a meanie to us this year. I don't want to use bad language on this channel, so climate change has not been very nice to us. All right, guys, hang on. I gotta untangle myself. All right, come on, back in line. Come on, off we go. Um, but yeah, that's um, that's part of either Mount Rosalie or Mount Evans, um, and uh, actually, yeah, earlier this year I, I took a trip to uh, uh, Mount Evans, and I, you know, I I went there with a friend and got a lot of good, you know, pictures and videos. It was it was well worth it too. It was really, you know, really really fun. Um, this is a particular friend, you know, he, he lives in Utah, and he comes out here, you know, sometimes, and, uh, you know, I don't get to see him too often, I text him a lot, but when I do get to see him, that's actually, you know, like, really fun, we, um, we do stuff, we met each other a few years back when my family and I were staying at a hotel, and I got to talking to him one night, and, he showed me pictures of his trip to Alaska, which, by the way, as you guys may have seen, I showed you the uh, boat and the bears and the salmon and the whales and the killer whales up up in Alaska. So we just got back from a cruise to Alaska. You guys also saw the totem poles, so that that was all up in Alaska. That was not, you know, down this far. So. We, I'm, you guys may have also seen Seattle and some of those um, 
photos and videos. We did stop in Seattle. We were in Seattle, you know, for for a bit. So, yeah, that was, you know, it was a really fun trip. And I, I, um, I plan on doing, you know, more of these videos as I go to different places throughout the world next year in terms of international because we did go to Canada but the pictures for some reason didn't load on the SD card properly so that really really sucked um, but I still remember Canada pretty well because we were we were only there for five hours but still it was wonderful um, and we we took a tour on a rickshaw the guy you know driving the rickshaw he was he was really nice we ate at a sandwich shop we passed by Chinatown that was in Victoria BBC and you know it was a really really fun trip you know I would definitely recommend it it's an Alaskan cruise and over there if you look you can see those rocks over there you know on the on the mountainside you know this is basically like down here this is this is basically a valley so it goes like all the way you know over there to the mountains way over here you know I wish we you know I'm I'm hoping we get more snow you know this this winter because let me tell you we need it pretty pretty darn badly we really could use the snow but anyways, guys, that is going to wrap it up for this video. So I really hope you all enjoyed it. And I will be seeing you guys later. I will be showing you guys my cats. So anyways, stay tuned for that. And uh, yeah, have a peaceful day, everybody. Thank you so much for watching and for subscribing. And um, make sure to subscribe to my main channel, Sims 3 Forever, dude. The link will be in the description. And I will... See you all in the next nature walk. Bye, everyone. Thank you again for watching. Have a peaceful day.